Okay, so this is a quick walkthrough on how to create a portfolio. What you see here is a Canvas dashboard. It'll have all your courses that you're currently taking. We're going to leave the dashboard and go to our account, and we'll find ePortfolios right there. If we click through to ePortfolios, we'll find a list of the portfolios you've already created. If you've created none, there will be none up here. This is the important button right here. Create an ePortfolio. You're going to create one. You click that and you give it a name. I'll give it my last name. I'll say Guar Portfolio 2000. Let's say 18. And we're not going to make it public. If you do, that makes things a little easier to share later, but it's not important and it's actually clearer how to share if you don't make it public. So we click Make ePortfolio. It takes a second to go through, and you land on what is called the Portfolio Dashboard. This is where you'll land every time you click on your portfolio. And something that's important that you'll hear from me a lot as you get instructions is this link right here. That's your sharing link. You left your ePortfolio private, which means this link right here is the only way you can share it with other readers. If they aren't signed in as you, they won't be able to view it unless they have this link. All right, but now if we want to uh, set up our portfolio, we just go to the actual portfolio and we find ourselves on a blank page. And all we have to do is edit this page. By editing this page, we can change our welcome to, let's say, uh, Guar Portfolio. And then uh, we're going to leave nothing entered yet blank because we're not going to use that space. What we're going to do is instead add content. Uh, if we've already selected our assignments, all we have to do is do image and file upload. When we click that, you can see down here below, I now have an image and file upload box, which will allow me to go choose a file. And I can go to any of these various assignments that I have picked here. And I can pick one and I can open that up. And after I've opened it up, I say, yeah, I want that I want that to go up there. That's there. That's my first assignment that I've uploaded. I save page. And now my readers can download the file that I've uploaded. That's all there really is to it. So if you can get through those steps, you have set up your portfolio.